mystery of stuff. Bitter winter in Chicago, especially for those living on the streets. Among the homeless community was an army veteran, but little did the former soldier know that there was someone looking for him, and they were about to give him something that would turn his life around. This remarkable story begins in Kansas, way back in 1980. It involves two men, a pawn shop, and some savings bonds. Nearly four decades later, the tale has finally reached a conclusion, and it's a truly uplifting story to recount. The first character to mention is Woodrow Wilson Jr. In 1980, he was a 21-year-old serving in the U.S. Army. But when money became a bit tight, Wilson decided that he needed to make a quick buck, and he knew that he had a few savings bonds worth $100 each. So he strolled into Jack and Dick's pawn shop not far from his military base in Fort Riley and handed them over. After that, he probably didn't think much about the exchange. Until now, that is. You see, at the end of 2017, that trip to the pawn shop came back into focus once more for the best reason. A man named Chris Mathis took charge of the pawn shop back in 1991. Then, in the process of organizing the store recently, Mathis discovered some things that intrigued him. Sure enough, he came across Wilson's old bonds, and they were no longer worth just $100 each. In fact, they had increased in value to more than 3,000 in total. With this in mind, Mathis was keen to track down the original owner of the bonds, but that didn't prove itself to be an easy feat, not by any means. In fact, Mathis spent a year trying to trace Wilson. The pawn owner and help the 